Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today I'm going to be doing a little bit of something different. This is just an update for something that I'm planning on doing within the next year or so. And that is getting some custom figs. So if you guys don't know, a few companies do this. I'm not sure how many. I do know AV Bricks and uh, Mini Pico does this. Where you, you can um, get custom prints. Um, for fix you can like you come up with your own designs you send them to them either you provide the parts or they do but um, The difference between this and just ordering regular figs is you get your own design and you get it tailored to how you actually want it to look um, but it is um, It is pretty expensive. They do cost a lot of money to just get these because um, These aren't designs they're coming up with the designs you're, you're coming up with and they have to you know actually make them so it's a custom custom order basically so it's um, gonna be pretty expensive I don't know exactly how much but I do plan on doing this and the total of figs I was thinking was around 10 different variants I already have six um, figs not designed. I haven't designed them yet, but I already know what I want and I have them kind of written down the different sort of, you know, form and parts to them. And the first six are basic SS. They're not, well, I mean, they're not basic. They have different, you know, sort of uniforms, but they're not really any particular unit. You can kind of just use this with sort of any type of SS unit and it kind of works. Um, but the other four, I'm trying, I was like thinking of particular SS units, they don't really get much, much get much coverage. They don't like get talked about a lot, and that's the Latvian SS group. Is that's the one I was thinking of doing because um, they did take part in a few battles, and not many people really kind of do much with them. Um, not many people mention them. I think like the like most infamous battle that they were part of was probably the Battle of Berlin, and that was it. Um, even then, they were in small numbers. So I want to do something with them because I thought they were a pretty cool unit. Um, but I haven't really designed it, their uniforms yet. And I kind of want to, like, um, I'm going to do a little bit of research to see what kind of kits they would need and what kind of, uh, like, if they used camos or what kind of uniforms they were wearing. And I want to kind of do, like, Make it to where like you could use these in like like plenty of battles. So it wasn't like I don't want to get like a uniform where it's like a particular like, hey these guys only wore like this uniform you know like in this battle and then for this battle they wore this uniform. I kind of want to get somewhere it's like they you know, they had like a uniform that could be crossed over into multiple different battles that they took place in. So it wouldn't be like, like just like with one uniform. So I want to kind of try to figure out what kind of uniforms they used in certain battles, what kind of kits they wore, so I know, like, what kind of... Because some, some, some units, um, some soldiers would, like, just drop certain parts of their uniform that they didn't really need, like a gas mask canister. Um, no units ever really needed to use that, so they just kind of just didn't use it, so... I kind of want to figure out what kind of stuff they had. But for the regular 6 SS figs, I already kind of have an idea of what I want um, to get. For the uniform, and those six are gonna have the same uniform, but for the Latvian SS, I'm gonna do some research to see what kind of kits they would be wearing and what kind of stuff they were required of them to wear. So that's pretty much it. Um, but yeah, this is just something that I was thinking about doing. Uh, I just need help with designing these because I already know what I want for six of them. I just don't really know how to design them. Um, and yeah, most of these figs, the only three colors I'm going to be using is dark bluish gray, um, dark tan, and old dark gray. Reason being, I'm not just using one gray. Why am I using both? It's because if you guys notice, like of many photos, German uh, soldiers um, would often have a mix match of different colors of gray. You would see a lot of soldiers with older cut, older uniforms mixed with newer uniforms. And the reason being is I'm trying to show that the German army is kind of, you know, disorganized a bit. So they have mixtures of old uniforms. So some soldiers, a lot of the older stuff was a lot better than the newer stuff that they were using. So they'd often like to keep the older uniforms. So I'm going to have like a mixed match of those. So you can see the newer ones 
would be like the um, dark bluish gray. The older ones would be like the older, old dark gray, so stuff like that. And yeah, that's kind of it. I just really need help kind of designing these. Um, I have an idea. I think I know somebody who does design figs or has, and I'm gonna try to see if they would help me with that. Um, but yeah, I already have um, six of them designed. Um, I'm probably not gonna make a whole bunch of these. I'm trying, I'm gonna try to keep it limited to the amount I'm making, because again, it is a lot of money to make these. And I kind of wanna keep it, because I wanna have enough to where like a few people will be able to own these, but I don't wanna have like so much to where like, you know, I'm having to go broke for these figs, because again, these are, these, these guys are not cheap. I wish they were, but they're not, so. I was thinking that maybe I could do like five sets, which is still, you know, something, but you know, I don't really know. I'm gonna try to figure it out to see how much it really does cost to make an individual fig, and then I'll just have to see. But this isn't gonna be, um, this isn't gonna be something that's gonna happen soon. This is gonna take like at least a year of saving up to really make these guys so yeah, I'm just letting you guys know on YouTube if you guys want to know or try to get some. I'm at least letting you guys know. Um, there's not, I don't really know how <laughs> to go about doing this, but this is just something I've been planning, wanting to do for a few months now. And it's something that I really do want to do because it's something cool. Plus, you know, I wanted to bring a unit that was that had, doesn't really have much coverage. Um, I want to do something with them because I don't really see many people doing that, do, doing the S Latvian SS unit. So, something I want to do. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, go check out my Instagram. I think I have it linked to my channel, I think, if you guys want to go check that out. If not, it's um, crazy with the K underscore pate, if you guys want to go check that out. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.